Tracy, right now the jury is deliberating as we speak. Their task will be to decide whether John Williams is guilty of murder or manslaughter in the shooting death of Corporal Eugene Cole last year. Now that decision will hinge on several things, but mostly on terms that we've heard very often throughout this trial, and that is the words intentional or knowing. Now, that's the standard for that murder conviction that the prosecution is seeking. The prosecution emphasized in its closing arguments that it can be either of those depending on what the jury finds. In their closing, they said that Williams shot from close range and that his actions after the shooting showed that he knew what he was doing at the time. Now, the defense disagrees. They told the jury that just because John Williams intended to pull the trigger, something that they've conceded from the start, doesn't mean that he intended intended to murder Corporal Cole. And they also argue that the drugs kept him from knowing what he was doing. The intent to cause death can be formed in the instant before the death producing conduct. So when John Williams put the muzzle of the nine millimeter up against Corporal Cole's neck, I submit to you the moment he pulled the trigger, John Williams either intended or was practically certain that death would result. You have evidence that he was extremely high. And he said he instinct it happened so fast, he just instinctively took out his gun and shot Corporal Cole, not to cause his death. He has never said that. He said he intended, his intention at that time was to get out of being arrested. The jury has now been deliberating for nearly an hour and a half. Members of Corporal Cole's family were here in the courtroom for opening statements as they await that verdict. Once the verdict does come down, we'll work to bring you that live right here on WMTW. Live in Portland, Joe Glauber, WMTW News 8.